Welcome back to PBJ, and as you guys can see, we have a lot of dirt here strategically placed. And that's because we are making some bigger dirt jumps. As you can see, the finished dirt jumps over here, and they're good, but we just want to go bigger. We just want to go a lot bigger. So, there's a huge pile of dirt here, and these jumps, we plan on building the face at least like seven or eight feet tall. But the goal is, in this video, is we're going to get the shark fin here, and that big jump all shaped up nice and packed and done we'd like to build a landing but we gotta find dirt somehow we're completely out of dirt so that will be interesting but yeah i want to throw you guys on the time lapse we're gonna get to work and just keep going and yeah should be so sick we're stoked So I got the whole front of the shark fin done, which I'm super stoked about. I'm kind of bummed. I put a little bit of uh, top soil on it to give the nice finish. It's a different color. Hopefully after some like rain and dryness, it will come up the same color. I don't know. I don't really know how that works. But I still got to do the whole back of this thing, which is not going to be as perfect as the front side of it. But I still want it to look nice. So I'm going to really wet it down, throw some dirt on it, and see what we can't get going on with. And... Yeah, we're making great progress. Next, we got that landing in that face, so let's get straight into it. Just like that, the shark fin is done. Now it's time to move on to the landing. Now that's probably the one thing I'll get done today, but we'll be finishing the landing in the next jump in this video. But for today, my goal was to get this done. And what I'm gonna do is kind of scrape off the top, I think, and get the big like boulder things that are hard to work with and just stack those by hand, and then throw that loose stuff back on top and see what kind of landing we can get going. So that's what we're gonna do. Three ways back on the tripod and let's get right back into it. So we're back here at the dirt jump. As you guys last saw, I was building this. And it looks done. This looks wicked wet, but it's pretty solid. So it should be good. Got all the boys here. PJ behind the camera. Got Max with us. And we're going to test this out. PJ has some worries about it, but I think we'll be okay. But we might as well test it before we move on to building that. So I'm going to head up there. Hopefully hit a first go. Who knows? And yeah, hopefully it goes good. We all got some worries, man. We all got worries, but yeah, this thing, it's something. It's something. That's perfect. Yeah, that was I pretty good. Up. I definitely came up a little short, but actually just barely made it. <laughs> so we'll try again, but it works really good. That lip's perfect. So let's run it again. Just barely made it. Some heads up riding, because I knew I wasn't making it. Yeah, you gotta, carry, you gotta carry some more speed into that. Yeah. Like big time. Yeah. That's scary. Yeah. 
Dude, that was the speed though. Like, that was the exact speed. I was like, oh, he has it. I thought I had it too, man. I don't know what it is. I think it's the fact you can't really see like the lift. You just kind of have to like hope you're gonna hit it. Cause you're like in it, in it, in it, and then look up. Yeah! 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 Oh, it felt great, dude. Like, I knew I was gonna do it, and I was like, eee! And that little hesitation's why I came up short. But if I didn't hesitate, but the lip feels really good, yeah. doesn't it? Like it no, throws like, you like perfect. <laughs> it was actually awesome. Oh! <laughs> Dude, it's so nice! <laughs> I told oh you guys, God. like, it's a perfect oh lip. It's so much fun. It's a perfect lip. Oh my goodness. But I don't think I've ever seen the ability think so good. <laughs> So next day we're back here on the jumps. As you guys have seen, it, me build the shark fin, ride the shark fin, which leads right into this big pile of dirt right here, which is gonna be the face of our first big jump. We got lucky and got a bunch of rain last night, so let's be able to stack this thing real high to like that seven foot mark, eight foot mark, probably more seven foot mark that I'm aiming for. And it's gonna be awesome. So I'm gonna throw you guys on the tripod, stack some dirt and keep you updated as I go. We're about a half hour in, probably closer to 45 minutes. And I got a good bit stacked in the front. We're probably sitting about six feet right now. But the issue is it's starting to fall down because I haven't got the back of this jump, which is not supported whatsoever. So let's let you guys back to the back of the jump. I'm gonna get the back going and get it probably looking pretty, like, pretty good. Then go back to the front, stack about another foot on this, and then we'll see the kind of shaping we can get going. It's really sticky, so I don't know how well I can get this shape because this thing's in my shovel really bad. But I'm going to try my darnest and let's get back here on the tripod. So I've just been fighting the back of this thing. It's just too wet to pack. It'd be perfect if I had some dry, dry dirt to throw on it and then it would pack real good, but don't got that right now. So, I don't think a ton of time lapse. I've been using my hands a lot and stacking it by hand. It's the best way to go after it. So since I can't pack, I'm on, these sides aren't looking great. So I'm gonna get my hand dirty some more and do the sides. Then I'm gonna do the face last. The sun is out. I'm hoping it will dry the dirt up just a little bit so I can pack it. So that's the plan. Get back from the time lapse, we'll get back after it. So I got the face as rough as I can. It's so sticky, so you're not doing any fine adjustments. But I was able to steal from topsoil from the mulch truck you can see back there and put that in the gator and we're going to throw that on his face, it's some really good dirt, so hopefully I can get this thing nice and shaped. And then the back looked like it was kind of drying up, so I went out, but really hoping I'll be able to pack that in and see where we are from there. But through the tripod and hoping get this thing looking good. I am really hoping. And the face is done. After a couple hours, I got it looking real good. Now the front part, I wasn't able to get cleaned up because it's just like so sticky and so muddy. My shovel ain't doing nothing. I have two shovels out right now. One weighs about 50 pounds and one I've just been packing with. But it's a light rain 
kind of coming through. I don't think it should bother me. I've just been battling this all day. But I got some more topsoil and I think we're going to do these sides next. See how far we get with this weather, but I'm going to keep working. Welcome back, day number four, and we are still working on this jump. Now, as you guys last saw, I got the face and the two sides done. And now the goal for today is to get this back done and it will be all complete. It is still a mess, but I should really clean up and make it look really good. So there's nothing more to do but to move some dirt. And we're done. After four days, able to get the shark fin done behind me and ride it and get this big old face done right here. I don't know if I hit seven feet. I think I'm pretty close, maybe just over six feet. It's definitely taller than me and I am six foot. But if you made it this far, make sure you drop a like, subscribe. You can even comment your thoughts and feelings. We'll listen to you or we won't, who knows. But make sure you check out our further videos and we'll see you next time.